Well, it lasts pretty hard to die. This is doing a one inch mini. Um, I guess finished about two months ago. Uh, it's gas barred, a ceramic burner I've made for it, and an integral gas tank. Um, I have to use a raisin blower to get the steam up so that I can use the blower valve which is needed. Um, shame the, the boiler wanted different designs for gas as it's designed for use for coal. But nevertheless it runs okay and it's a cleaner on this smaller size of engine. Backwards and forwards. Lubricator works fine. Throttle valve's a bit of a pain in the ass the way it's designed, but there you go. All or nothing bugger. Nice little engine, runs well, winch. Excuse me. Nice little canopy for those that like canopies. Whip it back off so you can see what's going on here. There we go. Let's whip the camera off of the tripod and try and get some. Uh, close up of it. Just open up the door so we can see the burner, what's going on inside of there. And there. Safety is just breaking. The engine likes to get really hot for everything sort of working properly, including the epoxy throttle valve. It needs a nice piece of pressure to keep it down on its seat. Apart from that, it's okay. Oh, she stopped. There she goes. Quite a nice engine. Runs well. Quite pleased with it, really. Very awkward trying to video this and operate at the same time. In a 6x4 bloody shed, yeah? Anyway, there she is. Anyway, that's it. I'm trying to get these on the computer now. And when the weather's a bit better, we'll give her a run inside in the yard. That's all for now. Well, 
going to show you a shot of the gas tank. There's the gas tank fits in straight in the back of the, the coal scuttle sort of the deal. Yeah. Get to the motion one. Lovely things, key are they? 